I think um, Absentia is, uh, let me put this down, sorry. Absentia is different, <laughs> just be right here. Absentia is different than other TV series because uh, I think it definitely involves a, a crime thriller element with the family drama that you don't, don't usually get to see. We really invest in characters the way that a show like Breaking Bad did, uh, Homeland um, does still, um, and like, you know, Hand, Handmaid's Tale, those kinds of shows that really dig deep into character and relationship drama as well as the um, traditional plot narrative. Uh, it's been very fun. Stana's, uh, she's a very hard worker. She's got a great emotional well um, to pull from. She can access those uh, very easily. Um, and uh, she's, you know, she's she looks incredible on camera. Uh, she's definitely built, uh, built for film and television. It's a uh, it was a real pleasure to work on it. Some of the best scenes I've ever shot in my life were with her. I'm enjoying it very much. I look forward for everybody to see those. Um, so how will Nick face the situation of my lost wife being found uh, while I'm now remarried? I can't really tell you that too much. I can tell you what you see in the first episode, which is uh, actually the first couple episodes, which is, uh, you know, obviously he's shocked. He's filled with joy simultaneously. Um, uh, the last six years of his life he's been living have been completely a lie um, and trying to figure out how to uh, put together the pieces and salvage um, a life that he lost uh, proves to be a very difficult task. Um, yeah, it is. It's really complicated for Flynn, our son. So what is it like when his mom shows up? Because for him, he never met anybody else. Um, he only knew his Alice, his his second mother. He never knew his birth mother. We visited her grave, his uh, mother's grave every year, but it was just a stone in the ground and he'd see pictures, but he didn't know her personality. He didn't know her her vibrancy or you know her vibe. Um, what her energy was like. Uh, and so that's all a lot for him to cope with and to handle and to also, he's only nine years old, so to um, intellectually grasp um, that she's alive again, I think also proves to be a difficult task for him. For sure, the, the biggest challenge for me as an actor with absentia was, was dealing with the kind of, with the physical trauma that my character's going through. Um, the lack of sleep and the psychological trauma all at the same time were very, I mean, it made me a little crazy sometimes while we were shooting. It would be out of sorts. I couldn't sleep. Uh, I wasn't eating well. Because you, one of the crazy things about acting is you, you can tell yourself it's fake and your mind knows it's fake, but your body thinks it's real sometimes. And so, um, so it can, you know, make you behave in ways that you don't normally.